It has been 17 years since nearly 3,000 people died in the September 11th terror attacks. A small Minnesota town has held a parade and service every year on this day to keep the memory of the tragedy alive. Reporter Rachel Johnson has our story. The town of Verndam, Minnesota puts on a service every year to memorialize the day and commemorate those who lost their lives in the September 11th terror attacks. We lost so many lives, it's important to remember those who um, gave their lives for our freedom on that day. And it's important we say we would never want to forget. Um, I think it's important that we tell our story of, of what it was like when we experienced it. The event begins with a parade as elementary students walk a couple of blocks from the school to Verndale Park. They uh, create some different banners and posters and flags. We want our kids to remember what happened back on September 11th, 2001. Even though Verndale is a small town with only less than a thousand residents, they get a big showing every year they do this memorial. We get a lot of community members who come out and, um, and join in, in this remembrance kind of ceremony that we have. September 11th was designated by Congress as the National Day of Service in 2009, inviting people to remember and pay tribute to the tragedy by giving back to their community. We ask our kids to go out to help remember that, that they go out and help their neighbors, their grandparents, their parents, um, so that they don't forget this day. For the school, it is important to continue the tradition of the service to keep the memory going, even when the students attending were not alive when the tragedy took place. I think it's important that we tell our story of, of what it was like when we experienced it um, and try and relate to these kids of, of what happened, why it's important, um, and that we continue to remember going forward. Even though we are approaching 20 years since the September 11th attacks, the victims, survivors, and the lives touched by the tragedy will never be forgotten. Reporting from Verndale, Rachel Johnson, Lakeland News. Memorial services took place across the country today, including one at the Memorial Plaza in New York City, where the World Trade Center Twin Towers once stood. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.